So this is a 2004 Chevrolet SSR, which stands for Super Sports Roadster. It is a V8 powered retro futuristic convertible pickup truck offered by Chevrolet, which pays homage to the late 1940s advanced design pickup trucks that Chevrolet produced. It features a V8 under the hood, luxury amenities on the interior, and a locking tonneau cover over the bed in the rear. And as you can tell, it looks fantastic. Now, if you lust after these as much as I do, this particular violet metallic example with just 37,000 original miles is actually up for sale. It's heading to auction at the 2024 Mecham Glendale Auctions as offered from Casio Motors. So that is your opportunity to purchase this exact truck I'll be showing you today as we go through the exterior, the interior, the powertrain, and of course, take it for a drive. So moving on to the exterior, this particular truck is finished in ultraviolet metallic, option code 21U, and it does a fantastic job of displaying the retro futuristic design and sporty nature of the SS. Are. As we take a look at the front, we have these vintage style circular headlamps, which are actually split down the middle by this nice silver bumper piece that then has a golden bow tie, but above it is Chevrolet spelled out, which looks like a piece that you could take directly off the SSR and put it right on the 40s advanced design trucks. On the side, we have these big pontoon fenders, which do a fantastic job of getting the retro point across and make the vehicle very unique and certainly a sight to behold when you see them on the road. As we take a look at some of the other features on the side, we have these marker lights on the side sides. Now these actually have Chevrolet bow ties in them, which is a nice attention to detail. We also have these 19 inch silver wheels and 20s in the rear, so it's actually a staggered setup. And this truck also has the sport suspension package, which means that we have four wheel disc brakes, which means disc brakes in the front and the rear. So better performance in that regard. As we move back, we have very sporty mirrors. The uh, windshield itself is a very nice rake, which makes it look very sporty. But most importantly is the convertible nature of this pickup truck. Now, because it's a powered convertible, it actually has controls on the interior to raise or lower the top in seconds. And it's even a hard top convertible, meaning it has improved noise resistance when you're on the highway, for example, and it looks better when parked. But whenever you want to have the wind in your hair, you could lower it and you have this nice flat back nature, which looks fantastic. And it even includes an SSR branded windshield to help keep the noise down when the top is down, which is very cool. So moving on to the backpack of the vehicle, we have these nice circular retro inspired tail lights and then we have SSR badging with the R of course having its own unique special badging but the SS retaining the original Chevrolet styling. One of the other cool features is actually the locking tonneau cover. So with your key fob you can actually unlock the top here. This top section now pops up and it is of course hydraulic so you don't have to hold it. You go ahead and drop the bed and now you can get access to the carpeted interior which has this nice wood grain lines here as well where you can store things and even tie things down but it's obviously not open. There's no way to look in, so you can store whatever you want in here and not have to worry too much about it and still have the accessibility and some usability of a pickup truck. Then to close it, you go ahead and drop the top here, and then you go ahead and close it up. And now your tunnel cover is locked, which is a very cool feature. On top of that, we also have dual exhaust for our V8, our reverse lights, and then even our Chevrolet bow tie hidden behind our license plate. Moving on to the interior, the retro theme continues. This particular truck is ebony or black and features this nice black textured material on the dash. And of course, we have some silver accents just like the exterior, but we also have some more body color, including the center console here. It rolls over the doors and then onto the dash. So you can continue to enjoy your awesome ultraviolet metallic paint job. Now we also have some luxury features like these seats which are in fantastic condition because of the mileage. They feature nice side bolstering but they're also powered and heated seats giving you more luxury amenities so you could have the top down and have your heated seats on if it's a bit chilly outside. You also get a Bose sound system which can be controlled by your controls in the center here or even using some of the controls on the steering wheel. You get your heater and AC climate control system in the center. We get a nice storage compartment but we get one of our cup holders here. And then this black box here on the side is again a factory cup holder. This is not an aftermarket. This is an SSR cup holder. In the center here, we have our automatic shifter control, which looks very retro, but we have our window controls, lock and unlock, tracks control, and of course our power convertible controls. We have a nice storage compartment here, which is where you can hold your SSR manual. On top of that, we also have a retro inspired gauge cluster, which also says SSR on it. And of course you get things like power mirrors, some of your 
uh, your garage controls if you wanted to store it that way. And of course you get your standard visors. So lots of cool features on the inside of the retro themed SSR. Under the hood is a naturally aspirated 5.3 liter V8. Good for 300 horsepower and 331 pound feet of torque, which comes paired with a four speed automatic transmission with overdrive and a Zexel Torsen limited slip differential, which means this truck is set up for performance. It'll do zero to 60 in about 7.7 .7 seconds with a quarter mile time of about 15.9 seconds. That's not too shabby for a pickup truck, especially a convertible pickup truck at that. The engine bay itself is nicely dressed up and even features its bespoke SSR badging with a nice chrome panel at the top here. We got our nice big intake up front, alternators up top, and of course we have power brakes and power steering, which are all great features to have in a vehicle like this. And it's gonna be easy to work on if you wanna do maintenance yourself. And of course, being a V8, it sounds absolutely fantastic. Take a listen. What's it like to drive the SSR? Well, because we're gonna enjoy it to the fullest, we're gonna go ahead and have the top down. So there's gonna be some wind noise. But by also having the top down, you can hear the V8. Which sounds pretty good. The car drives really smoothly. I would say it doesn't drive like a truck, which is a huge plus. If you've ever driven a truck, especially the older the truck, they don't drive that well. But the SSR drives a lot better than anything that would have come out of the time period. It's a lot smoother. Now that's probably in part thanks to the sport suspension that you'll find on this particular vehicle. And obviously it comes to a stop pretty fast too, thanks to the four wheel disc brakes. But the overall experience is really good. You of course have the rake of the windshield, but the visibility is pretty good. The flat back means it's easy to see behind you and even the slight visibility of the pontoon fenders means it makes it a little bit easier to see where your wheels are as well while you're cruising in the SSR. But all in all, the open top experience doesn't get much better than that. Not to mention that it's available with a truck and a convertible muscle truck essentially is what the SSR is. So it's an enjoyable experience. And with just 37,000 miles on this particular truck makes it a fantastic buy. If you're looking for one to either keep in storage and enjoy on the weekends, or if you're looking for a daily driver, this one's got plenty of life left in it. And it's a unique experience that is for sure gonna get looks wherever you take it. So, so with that, that's gonna be the end of the video. If you're looking to purchase an SSR, this particular truck will be at the 20 2024 Mecham Glendale auctions as offered by Casio Motors. So there's your opportunity to bin, bid to win this SSR. If you enjoyed the video, hit that like button. I'd really appreciate it. And consider getting subscribed for more content like this in the future. With that, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.